648 after a long week. It's great to celebrate another school as our school of the week. Morning reporter DJ Anthony joins us live in studio. So TJ, who gets the honor this week? Look, this week we are celebrating Dames Ferry Elementary School where they're creating quite the buzz by teaching kids about agriculture and STEM by adding some sweet honey to the mix with a little beekeeping. Here at Dames Ferry Elementary School, they're an agriculture STEM based school. So each grade level focuses on a piece of agriculture. On third grade, we focused on composting and worms, which I was like, worms, mm, no. But then once I came there, I started working with them. I kind of started getting better and better. Taylor Paul is now in fourth grade, where beekeeping and pollination are teaching students more than just how bees make honey, but also the role of sustainability um, and how important agriculture is to the industry in Georgia. The students and both the fourth grade teachers, Kristen White and Danielle Wheeler, all suit up together in order to care and look after the forever buzzing pollinators through being their own beekeepers. Pollinators are responsible for 75% of the leading food crops and it's a $27 billion industry in the United States. Not only are students studying ecosystems, they're learning about food chains. Um, we actually tie beekeeping into every single one of our science units. Paul says she's learned a lot. I thought bees were just animals that would sting you. But now, with her school's hands-on program, she knows. That bees are one third of our food, and they pollinate the flowers. And I also learned that bees help us live, which is good because they help us with the environment. We are Dane's Fairy, and we are the School of the Week. Yay! Now, believe it or not, I did suit up with those kids. And after a while, they'll be able to harvest the honey from those bees that you just saw in the story.